Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Grace Melody here, and today we are continuing with Sonic Adventure DX. So we have a new story to start. We have 100% is Sonic, Tails, Knuckles, and Amy, and next we have Big the Cat. So I'm actually super stoked for this. I know a lot of people hate Big Story, but I actually find it quite fun. It's nice doing something different especially after the annoyance that is Amy's story. If you didn't watch me play Amy's story, I don't like her. I, I, I find her story to be the most boring. But you know, big, big I like his levels. Also, most obvious power up in the entire game. It's always nice. So, Big and Froggy live together in the Mystic Ruins and then Froggy hears something and he goes to explore and it's chaos. Can we talk about how fun Big's music is as well? Like this is great. He's so cute. He's so cute. So then he sees Froggy. But Froggy looks weird because Froggy has... <laughs> Froggy has grown a tail. Which, as you may know, is a bit abnormal for Froggy. So then... Froggy decides to eat Big's Chaos Emerald, which is his lucky charm. So Big's very sad. Because his best friend Froggy has ran off, and not just ran off, he's also taken his lucky charm. So it's very sad, very sad story. He's a sweetheart, is Big. Oh. <laughs> Polywog Palpy. I still don't know what Polywog is, but obviously it just reminds me of Polywag, so I'm like, yes. Okay, so I know Twinkle Park is thirst, but first things first, I believe there may be a upgrade around here, possibly? Yes. Lure power up. He uses to catch bigger fish. So at some point I am probably gonna need, I think at some point I might need all the power ups. Or maybe I don't. It might just be I need those for the missions, but obviously I'm, I'm only going for the story mode on this one. Hello. I have to go in a different way, don't I? Okay, let's go. Do, do, do. Yeah. So I have to go under the car first. <laughs> He's just so cute. I love Big. And then to solve this problem, Big just uh, yeets the entire car. <laughs> okay, so if we go this way, uh, the box that was here for Sonic Story has magically moved. Very helpful, very helpful. And now we can get up here. <laughs> his tail, his poor little tail gets caught. And we can go to Twinkle Park. How convenient is that? Okay. Welcome to Twinkle Park. So this is Froggy. <laughs> this is Froggy's. This is Big's first level, and we are fishing for Froggy. So it's pretty simple. All we need to do is cast our lure and wait for Froggy to bite. And there he is. Can I move closer to him? Then he might notice me. Notice me, Senpai? Please notice me, Senpai. Where did Froggy go? 
that big fish is going to notice me, isn't it? Oh, oh, there's Froggy. And then all you have to do, I, I don't remember if it's you hold down or if, if it's press down or press A, but I just do both. Just press down and A and then you have a hit. And I think the reason some people struggle is because they don't realise you have to press anything to get him. Oh, he's stuck, isn't he? Oh no, there we go. So some people can spend literally like 20 minutes getting froggy on one level and it's like, no, it takes a minute and obviously I'm not the best player ever, but even I can catch him in a minute. <laughs> it is funny watching people not realise that. Like, I personally am a huge fan of Game Grumps. I think their gaming videos are absolutely hilarious. I probably said this earlier in the series, but they're one of the reasons I wanted to start uploading videos myself. And, um, hi Cream! <laughs> and, you know, I. I'm going the wrong way. You know, I. Uh, their Sonic Adventure, of course, I was going the right way. Their Sonic Adventure gameplay, I, I do find it entertaining, but it's just like. It's entertaining in the annoying way because it's like. Oh, wait, it, I just realised. That's not where the ice stone went, that's just where it goes in Sonic's story. I wasn't paying attention. Um, it's like, it's really funny to watch it, don't get me wrong. But like, from a fan of the game point of view, it's like, come on dude, obviously it's not there, why would it be there? No. I just said the completely wrong thing because I was thinking of the ice stone, but not <laughs> watching their video where they're doing the big levels and Aaron is slowly losing his mind and Donna is laughing. Part of me is laughing along too because it's hilarious but the other part of me is like dude just just press A. Just press A dude. I'm pretty sure it's A that you need to press. Like I said it's, it's either A or down but for me it was always intuitive it's something that I naturally did so to me, it's funny when I see people not do it. <laughs> but I, I understand the confusion. It probably is taught to you somewhere if you speak to like the 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 glowing orb of wisdom, as I like to call to Carl in this. Okay, so next up we are going to Ice Cap. Oh, there, I think there's another power up in here, isn't there? Is there not? Um, okay, I thought I got the floaty power up in here. Maybe I get it in the level. I know I'm supposed to have it, so <laughs> we'll see. I probably do get it in the level. I'll probably get it if I go up here. <laughs> right, so I need to knock the boulder off, don't I? Of course I managed to land in the exact wrong place. Okay. I've got to say, this is probably what uh, like my least favourite big level just because the poor fella is not designed for platforming. Like it's, it's not, not his specialty let's say. Um. Oh god no, why did I fall? That's not fair. Because there's no boulders down here, is there? Oh wait, there is. Oh nice, okay. Okay, so I think... I think it's this fishing hole. Oh yeah it is, there he is. There we go. He's sinners. There we go. And then, yeah, I didn't explain it properly, but all you have to do is hold A and not break the line. So you just can't hold A for too long, but it's pretty fun. So we got a minute and a half on that one. I don't know why I was bothering to go up if I didn't need to. 
I thought that I had to go up there and that the boulder was up there, but you know, I, I, I'm wrong. <laughs> it happens occasionally. Oh, there is the power up. I get the feeling that that was there before the level. I'm just blind. You've discovered the life belt. Woo! You afloat when you are in water. Nice. When underwater, press the jump button when afloat. I shall floating orb of wisdom. Okay, so we've officially done two levels as big. Uh, I get the feeling next will probably be a cutscene because we seem due for a cutscene. Trying to remember what level's next. Oh, it is a cutscene. I was right. Oh, it's gonna be with Tails, yeah. It's gonna be when Tails catches Froggy. Yeah, he really looks like he's gonna hurt him. That was an intense vibration. Tails is like mortified because he's a scaredy cat. Oops. <laughs> Just oops. <laughs> ribbit, ribbit. <laughs> Okay, so Tails, what do you have to say to yourself? If I had only held on tighter. Yeah, I'm gonna go find him again. Okay, so I'm gonna leave this episode here for now. This is the first um, episode of Big Story. And if you wanna see me continue it, make sure you subscribe and then you'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching and I hope to see you next time. Bye bye.